you guys and welcome back to Still Looking Good 58. I am Faith and I have a new unit from Bobby Boss and it's a different line that I've used before. It's called Ascara. I don't know if you guys are familiar with Ascara, but Bobby Boss has had this Ascara line forever because I remember when I first started reviewing wigs back in 2018, they had the Ascara line then. And mostly, the wigs that I saw were blonde or blondish, and they were more silky than yakky. So let me show you a picture of the one that they sent me. This one is called B112 Chrissy. This is B112 Chrissy. And she comes in a lot of interesting colors. The color that I have for Chrissy is Caramel Kiss. Caramel Kiss. And she comes in a lot of colors, but these colors are a little bit different than the colors you might be used to from Bobby Boss. Um, a lot of them are basically unique to the Escara line. So let me show you the one they sent me, Chrissy, the Caramel Kiss one. Here she is. Just a short pixie unit. And this particular unit, um, it doesn't have any lace at all. So if you don't like lace, then this might be for you. It has your typical cap construction. It has a comb in the back. Uh, well, actually, that's not true. It doesn't have a comb in the back. It has adjustable straps, but no combs. Oh, no combs? Let me just make sure. Yeah, no combs. Just an adjustable strap in the back. That's interesting. So I like the color of this Caramel Kiss. And I requested this color when they said they wanted me to review an Ascara unit. Not all of them are short, but most of them are. And if I can get uh, a copy of the, some of the other wigs, I'll put them up here so you can see them. Um, but yeah, they are usually short. Not all pixie, but they're usually short. And this texture, it feels silky, but it could also get away with being light yakky. So I'm going to go ahead and put a cap on my head and I'm going to see what we can do to uh, style this wig Chrissy. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, I got a cap on. You guys know my hair has grown like crazy so I'm trying to stuff it up in here as best I can. I'm going to go ahead and put a wig grip on to make sure that it just doesn't go anywhere. So we're going to do that. Alright, so here is Chrissy. And let me just show you the picture again. This is, a, this is another set of pictures of her so that you can see the way they've styled the unit. Okay, so it's probably going to be one of those wigs where you're just going to have to put it on your head and just kind of figure it out as you go. Okay, so since there's no combs, there's nothing for me to stick up under the back of my head. <laughs> but this is her initially, okay? This is her initially. So, um, I'm just going to mess around with her. Let me just pull this camera up closer so I can see what I'm doing. I'm going to mess around with her just to kind of see where I might take her. Because with a unit like this, you know, you can either fluff it out or you can leave it be. It looks to me like they fluffed it out a lot in the picture and then started styling it from there. Um, not really sure what I want to do with this or where I want to go with this. Um, yeah. I'm just going to fluff her out some. And it seems to me like, I mean, you can't really part a unit like this because it doesn't have any lace. So, let's see. This is going to be one that you're going to have to kind of decide where you want her to, to be and then keep her there because um, styling this one is kind of interesting. Okay, ladies, I kind of gave up and decided to do something different. I decided to put some curls in this. Uh, I decided to cut bangs and curl them up and I just dropped all my curlers on the floor. But this is what I did. I just want some bangs on this unit. And so putting some bangs on this unit. Now, granted, this probably needs to be curled up too on the sides. I could probably put some hot rollers on the sides and curl these up too so they'll flip up better. 
but really this unit once you start brushing it out is going to lose its curl so you're going to want to put some hot rollers in it so i just put some hot rollers in the front so that i could make some bangs and now i actually feel like it's something that i could possibly wear so other than that trying to really mess with it in terms of moving it around and all the things that the picture was showing i don't even know what i did with the picture but anyway, trying to move everything around to show what the picture had on it uh, just wasn't working for me. But I think this is cute. Um, cutting bangs into it, I think, really made a difference for me because there's no lace, there's no part, so there's really not a whole heck of a lot you can do. So I'm thinking that bangs is probably the best uh, bet. So what do you guys think? Um, I think this unit could use a lot of reconstructing i think they need to go back to the drawing board on this one because i really didn't like it that much i mean i really had to struggle to get even this going so i'm thinking that a wig like this that doesn't have any lace and doesn't have um you know any combs or anything in it a, a basic skin top part wig like this well actually it's not even a skin top because it doesn't have a part but a wig like this needs to be able to maintain its curl number one even if you brush it, it needs to maintain its curl for the most part. But these were like getting really flat and I didn't like that. It's going to need hot rollers. And you may not even want to be bothered with that. But what I would suggest that you do if you're going to get a wig like this and, and put hot rollers in it, just put the wig on the mannequin head, put the hot rollers in it and leave it. Then the next day when you take them out, everything should be peachy cane. So yeah, I put the hot rollers in here just for the bangs because I wanted to put some bangs in this unit because I think it looks cute now that it's got those. But yeah, this one was a struggle. Um, I'm not going to rate it <laughs> because um, Bobby Boss sent me this unit for free and so, you know, I'm not feeling like I'm out anything for this unit, but um, I think it's cute for some people, but it's just not for me. So if you guys uh, like this unit, you can get it. Again, this is Ascara. She's Brittany. I mean, not Brittany. I'm sorry. Her name is uh, Chrissy. B111 Chrissy. That's her B111 Chrissy. And if you can get her to look like that, you know, you're a good one. I sure couldn't. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. And as I always say, if you're going to show love to anyone today, please show it to the creator. I'm still looking good. And of course, so are you. See you next time.